This is part six of our negotiation book, The Introduction, Integrative Bargaining. Now we've already covered the idea of distributive bargaining, distributive being win-lose. Integrative is another way to say win-win, and this is what we always talk about in business, right? I want you to remember, however, I really do think this is a much more rare situation and even though you may want this situation, it doesn't mean it happens. Both sides need to be involved and really need to be honestly working towards that win-win or integrated, integrative uh, situation. So let's look at an example of what we're talking about just very quickly in introduction to this chapter. And we often use a pie as an example of how to understand negotiation, right? Um, we could have said that distributive bargaining is like a pie, or I think we said it was like a pizza. And if I get one slice, you lose one slice. You don't get that slice, right? The pie is, I get this piece, you don't get this piece. So if there's one piece left, I get it, but you don't get it. Now, of course, we could cut the pie in half, and that's called a compromise. And I think it's important to remember that uh, integrative bargaining is not about compromise. Rather, it's about a win-win situation where both sides can get what they want without losing what they want. So they both get what they want without losing anything that they want. That's different than compromise. Compromise means I get half of what I want and I lose half of what I want. You get half of what you want and you lose half of what you want. So very different approach. Now on the win-win or the integrative bargaining, we need to think about how does this work? Because the situation is not very different from a normal negotiation. We both have differences. Both sides have things that they want, goals that they want. But the question is, how can we make it win-win? Well, in a win-win, the key factor to creating this situation is both sides want win-win and both sides understand each other and what they can give and what they can take that will satisfy both sides. And this is where things become extremely uh, iffy or um, difficult because both sides need to be very honest and feel comfortable with each other and trust each other. So if I tell you that what I need to win is $10, but I'm not being honest, then when you give me $10, you've lost because you've given me more than you could have given. So we both need to be honest, and that is where things fall apart because you can ask, you know, are you being honest? And of course they'll say, oh yeah, I'm being honest. And you ask me, are you being honest? Oh yeah, I'm being honest. Of course everyone says they're being honest. No one says, no, I'm, I'm not being honest. I'm not telling the truth at all. Uh, this is a distributive negotiation and I would like to win more than you. Nobody says that. They always say, let's make this win-win. So how do you know if it really is win-win? Well, that's the hard part and there's no easy answer to that. But if the win-win is going to succeed, the integrative solution is going to really work, then both sides really need to get everything they want. Everything both sides want, they get. So they need to know what their goal is clearly. If you don't have a goal, there's really no way an integrative negotiation can happen or succeed because nobody knows what they want. Each side just wants to get more, 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 more. And that, that can't happen. So a key point is clarity on the goals. And then another key point is to share the goals. I know your goals, you know my goals. So this is this openness. We need to be open to each other. Both sides need to be open and honest. That is not an easy thing to do because we have emphasized secret information, haven't we? So what happens if one side is thinking win-win, but the other side is not thinking win-win? I say, well, I'm being honest to you. Tell me your secret information. And you tell me honestly. And I tell you my secret information, but it's not true. Well, you're going to lose and I'm going to win. You see? So just because we say win-win doesn't make it happen. There really needs to be an openness or an honesty or a trust between both of the sides. So it sounds great that there's a win-win, but it doesn't really work that way. So I want you to be careful because the one thing I worry about is you're going to think, hey, 
Uh, I'm just going to do my RPG. I'm going to play the negotiation game with our classmates and we're all going to be friends because I trust you. And I'm going to tell you my secret information and it ends up you lose. Why? Because you're not paying attention that it was not open and honest and it was not integrative, it was distributed. So integrative is wonderful, it's powerful, it can make everyone win, but it's rare and it's difficult, it's challenging. Yeah.